2024 is just a few days away, and next year will be filled with big sporting events and big news events, including, of course, the presidential election. So let's take a look at some key dates to circle in your calendar. Let's start here. President Biden is campaigning to keep his job at the White House. He isn't facing a significant challenge in the Democratic primaries, but there is a contest on the Republican side where former President Donald Trump leads in the polls. Iowa Republicans kick off the primary season when they caucus right here on January 15th. Then voters in New Hampshire and South Carolina cast key ballots in the following weeks. The next major date is Super Tuesday. That is, of course, March the 5th. And that's when 17 states and territories lock in their choices for their party's nominations. Now, once the parties have their nominees in place, general election date will, of course, be right here, circle that one a lot, November the 5th. But there's also big legal dates on the calendar related to the election. And let's check some of those out. Of course, because you've got former President Donald Trump. He's not just campaigning for president. He'll also be standing trial in four different criminal cases next year. The first trial is expected to start on March the 4th, right here. And that one is over charges of federal election interference. But March is going to be really busy for the former president. Just a few weeks later, right here on March 25th, he's going to schedule to be headed to a Manhattan courtroom to face allegations of falsifying business records to hide campaign finance violations. Both these trials could get delayed as appeals courts weigh in on Trump's claims of presidential immunity from criminal prosecution for official acts. But his legal calendar is still very much Jan. Then you've got May 20th. He's right there. That's the classified document handling case. That kicks off. And after that, he's got a potential summer trial. That's the Georgia election interference case. That one doesn't have an official start date yet, but prosecutors have requested it to begin right here on August the 5th. Donald Trump has pleaded not guilty in all these cases. All right. Enough politics. Let's get to something fun. Let's get to sports. It is, of course, the Olympics. The Olympic Games kicks off in Paris right here on July the 26th. It lasts 18 action-packed days till you get those very cool closing ceremonies on August the 11th. This Olympics will be the first to feature new sports. They've got breakdancing, and you'll also get the return of famous athletes like the great American gymnast Simone Biles.